Right now, an object from another star is hurtling through our solar system at a staggering 60 kilometers per second. It's showing all sorts of strange signs, like wild brightness changes and other weird behaviors. In just a few days, it's going to make its closest pass to the sun. And the big question is, what's going to happen next? Today, we are diving deep into one of the most mysterious objects ever spotted in our cosmic backyard. Comet 3i Atlas. This is only the third confirmed interstellar visitor we have ever managed to track, and scientists are working around the clock to study it before it disappears back into the vast emptiness of space. So, let's start with how we even found this thing. On July 1, 2025, the Atlas Survey Telescope in Chile spotted what looked like a faint fuzzy dot moving against the backdrop of stars. At first, it didn't seem like a big deal. But when astronomers calculated its path, they realized they had stumbled upon something truly extraordinary. This object wasn't orbiting our sun. It was just passing through. Think of our solar system as a giant cosmic roundabout. All the local traffic, planets, asteroids, comets, they're all circling in pretty much the same direction. But 3i Atlas? It's like it's driving the wrong way on a hyperbolic trajectory. That's a fancy way of saying it came from far beyond our solar system and has no plans of sticking around. Even stranger, it's in a retrograde orbit, moving in the opposite direction to almost everything else. By late October, it will reach perihelion, its closest point to the sun, passing relatively near the orbit of Mars. After that, it's going to get a gravitational slingshot, flinging it back out into interstellar space and we will probably never see it again. But this is where things start to get really weird. When scientists aimed the James Webb Space Telescope at 3i Atlas, they expected to see the usual comet ingredients, water ice, some carbon monoxide, maybe a little methane, you know, the standard cosmic recipe. Instead, they found something completely different. This comet's atmosphere, its coma, is dominated by carbon dioxide. The ratio of carbon dioxide to water is completely off the charts compared to any comet from our own solar system. Now, comets rich in carbon dioxide aren't unheard of, but this is extreme. It suggests that 3i Atlas formed in a very different environment than our own comets. Perhaps its home star system was much colder, or the planet forming disk around its star had a totally different chemical mix. This one visitor is giving us an incredible, direct look into the chemistry of an alien solar system. And the strangeness doesn't stop there. When astronomers measured the polarization of sunlight reflecting off 3i Atlas, they found something they had never seen before. Polarization is basically a fingerprint for dust grains. It tells us how they scatter light. In this case, 3i Atlas has one of the most extreme polarization signatures ever recorded. It's like meeting someone whose fingerprints are spirals instead of the usual loops and whirls. This suggests its dust grains might have exotic structures. Maybe they're unusually dark, porous, or coated in some strange material. Some scientists are even entertaining the idea that the grains themselves are made of materials totally unlike anything we find in our solar system. If that's true, 3i Atlas could represent a whole new class of interstellar object. Now here's a real head-scratcher. When comets get close to the sun, they heat up and release gas. This outgassing acts like a tiny rocket engine, pushing the comet slightly off its predicted path. But 3i Atlas, even though it's clearly active and spewing out gas, hasn't budged from its trajectory. It's following a purely gravitational path, as if nothing is happening at all. One possible explanation is that this comet is much denser or more massive than it appears. Imagine a bowling ball covered in a thin layer of cotton candy. From a distance, it looks fluffy and light. But if you try to push it, you'll quickly realize there's something solid underneath. Another idea is that the outgassing is perfectly symmetrical, so all the little pushes cancel each other out. For now, it's all speculation. I know what some of you are probably thinking. Could it be artificial? Let's address the elephant in the cosmos. Every time we find something weird out there, from Oumuamua to 3i Atlas, the speculation runs wild. And look, 
It's fun to imagine, but science demands that we look at the evidence objectively. If 3 Eye Atlas were an alien probe, we would expect to see certain signs, radio signals at unnatural frequencies, spectral lines from manufactured materials, or course corrections that can't be explained by natural forces. So far, we see none of that. Every observation is consistent with a natural object, just a really, really weird one. Its trajectory is purely gravitational. Its composition, while unusual, is made of natural elements. Its light signature shows no artificial patterns. That said, and this is important, good science means staying open to new evidence. If future observations reveal something truly anomalous, something that breaks the known laws of physics or chemistry, that's when we'd need to seriously reconsider. Until then, the alien probe hypothesis remains science fiction. The real story of 3 Eye Atlas is plenty exciting on its own. Right now, telescopes all over the world are locked onto this visitor. The Webb Telescope is continuing to analyze its chemical makeup, while ground-based observatories are measuring its dust and watching for any changes. What scientists are really hoping to get are its isotope ratios, the relative amounts of different atomic variants. These ratios could tell us about the temperature, pressure, and chemical conditions in the star system where 3i Atlas was born. Looking at the bigger picture, 3i Atlas is just a preview of what's to come. The Vera C. Rubin Observatory, which is starting up soon, will dramatically increase our ability to spot these interstellar visitors. Some experts think we might find tens of them every year once it's fully operational. Each one will be a messenger from a different star system, carrying secrets about worlds we may never be able to reach. Think about the journey this comet has taken. Millions, maybe billions of years ago, something violent happened in its home system. Maybe two giant planets had a close encounter. Maybe its star captured a rogue planet that threw everything into chaos. Whatever happened, 3i Atlas was ejected into the vast ocean of space. For eons, it drifted through the interstellar void, a frozen time capsule carrying the chemical signature of its birthplace. It passed through regions we can barely imagine, through giant molecular clouds, and past countless other stars. And then, purely by chance, its path crossed ours. We have this tiny window just a few months to study a visitor from another world. To learn about chemistry that happened around a star, we will never see. And to get a glimpse of the incredible diversity of planetary systems throughout our galaxy. So, what do you think we'll discover as 3i Atlas gets closer to the sun? Will it behave as expected or will it surprise us again? Drop your thoughts in the comments below. I read every single one. And if you enjoyed this deep dive into one of astronomy's newest mysteries, do me a favor and smash that like button and subscribe for more cosmic content. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.